Hi everyone, Adrian Hughes here, and today we're taking a look at the LG G-Pad 8.3 running the Cyanogen Mod 12, which is Android Lollipop 5.0.2 and we're taking a look at some benchmarks for those of you interested. So first of all we have Antutu benchmark. So we'll just bring that up now. As you can see we've run the test and it's given a score of 24,564. So as you can see here it's above the Zenfone 5 but uh, below a lot of the other phones out there. As you can see further up the list, uh, HTC One, the G3, Nexus 5, Xiaomi, Mi 3, Mi 4, Huawei, Mate 7. Um, so as you can see even though this is a Snapdragon 600, which is the same as the original HTC One M7, it's still a fair bit below. There's some overview schools there. See here, it's Snapdragon 600, which is APQ8064. I think a lot of that scores to do with the fact that it's using the old Adreno 320 GPU, which carried over from the Snapdragon S4 and S4 Plus. So, you know, devices like the Lumia 920, 1020, um, Nexus 4, etc., which had the S4 Plus. So, basically, the uh, CPUs had a bump, but the GPU stayed the same. Um, but this is quite a lot more fluid since it's using the ART Android runtime on Lollipop than on the LG 4.4.2 update. So this is a Geekbench score here, 537 for single core, 1665 for multi-core. Uh, it's not the greatest but uh, it'll do. So, some detailed scores for those of you interested. Sorry, but uh, you probably have to pause that if you want to get in there. Now, this is the comparison. So, as you can see, it's a bit below the original Galaxy S4, which is also running a Snapdragon 600, and below the Snapdragon S4 Pro. So, of the Nexus 7, but. Uh, uh, too bad. It's not too bad. Here's the multi core scores. So I hope that uh, gave you a bit of a general look at how things are running. Uh, as always, benchmarks aren't everything, and um, yeah, it, it does run quite smoothly and more fluidly than the Android 4.4.2 update by LG on here originally on this LG G-Pad 8.3 because let's face it I don't think LG has any intention of upgrading this tablet to Android Lollipop. Anyway thanks for watching and uh, like, comment, subscribe if you uh, like this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.